Making money like I'm in Laying in my eyes like shrimp Mint condition that I'm in Coming with the freshness Last night I finished the third upper cabinet Today's project is priming them and getting them ready to paint. And I also ran a couple more wires. So from where the electrical power box will be, ran some wires up through the ceiling, dropped them down here. And one of these will be for a switch. And then the other one will be for uh, the lights. So I'll have lights over the bed area and lights over the kitchen area. I also have to run another wire for an outlet that I will have up here. So this will be a 110 outlet. So I'm going to run another cable from there over the ceiling again and then down into the power box. And then we'll be set to put up our paneling up here and then start hanging the upper cabinets. Yeah. Today we are working on face frames for our cabinets. So I'm going to be building face frames for all three of my uppers and I'm going to be using um, Poplar 1x2s. So again a little pricey but I'm only building a few cabinets so it's worth, worth the cost to me. So these are the other two. So the goal is to knock those out today and get them primed and painted and then tomorrow try to get these hung up in the van. So let's get to it. Woo. and then mark where I'm going to need to drill out my pocket holes because I'm going to connect these using the Craig jig and a little bit of glue so I'm going to start doing that now.
are the three face frames that I just made. Pretty stoked with how they turned out. Uh, the first one I made a little mistake so I had to just redo one piece because it was a bit too small. Uh, but the rest of them worked out great. So I'm going to get these all sanded and prepared and we're going to do some priming and some painting and hopefully get those attached today. So I made quite a bit of progress in the last few days and I didn't film it, sorry about that. But I finished my face frames and then actually got my cabinets hung up and really stoked with how these turned out. They feel extremely solid and secure. You can check the whole damn van. Um, this is what I ended up using to attach the cabinets to the walls. There's these cabinet screws, inch and three quarters. These worked out great. I put like two or three in. Obviously that's not all I was gonna put in, but I put two or three in and they felt already just like crazy secure. So I ended up putting, you know, a few up on these top frame strips and then a couple on the bottom. And then I was able to hit above in my upper frame strips. So I did that in all three cabinets again. Really stoked with how these came out. Um, the project overall was fairly difficult just because of all these random curves and nothing's level in the van. So, you know, you put a level on here and you can't really tell if it's level because it depends where you parked. Um, so just a lot of fun things to deal with. If you have any questions about these uppers, about how I did mine in general, just leave me a comment below. And as always, I will be posting videos throughout my van build so please subscribe if you're interested and we'll see you next time